It's beyond oh, some wow. she. Wow, that's what we doing? What are you talking about? You just got my number upstairs, hey, and now you with a whole nother Wait, chick. This is my girlfriend. That's your girlfriend? This is my really? Girl that's your man? So that's what you was doing upstairs? Baby, I don't even know this woman. He just got, he just took my number upstairs. You been drinking? He just took my number upstairs. Come on, check his phone. I asked you what time it was. Check his phone. That's what we doing. Babe, don't even believe We coming out to a venue and you hollering at other women? Really? I don't even, I don't you, don't, you don't got my number? You're crazy. You don't got my number. You're delusional. You don't have my You're number. You're on drugs. You don't have my number. You need prayer. Check his phone, boo. Let me see your phone. He check just, Oh. He just he just stored me on the new boo. Open it up. New boo. Yes. I don't even know you. You just took my number. He's been doing drugs. Check his phone. Uh, Call my phone. I, I better don't ring. Call my phone. No, I bet it don't check ring. his phone. He Call saved my phone. It. I bet it don't ring. Oh, so you gave me a fake number? Even you were just hollering at me upstairs. All right, all right, we out of here. I don't have oh, now, oh, okay. So that's what we do. Yeah, yeah. See, this is why y'all ain't shit. Yeah, you ain't, ain't shit. shit. Hey, you know what? You ain't hey, shit. Fuck you. Fuck you too. Fuck you then. Fuck your sister. And you bow legged. Listen. You bow legged. Listen, sister. I'm leave him. He ain't shit. 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 Don't call me. Don't go text me. Don't text me. Don't call me. You a loser. You ain't shit. God bless. Okay, sister, run. Run, sister, because he ain't shit. He ain't shit. And he got his butt cheeks hanging out. Yo, fellas, what's good? What's going on? What it do? It's KC the Red Pill Alpha back at y'all again with that heat. You already know what time it is. Wrists, elbows, knees, feet, shin, and everything to the back of her neck. Holding it down, locking it down, submerging it down with that game. Please like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell. So when I'm done with these videos, pipe in hot status, you're going to get it down your phone until your ear or your candy game. Facts. How to get at me? <clears throat> Excuse me. Go to the description below my videos and you'll see everything there. Holler at me or to my about section. You know, there's another way to get at me. Everything there as well. My video for education purposes only. Fair use only. Fellas. Women. Teenagers only. Oh, oh, senior citizens, you know, I think we at that thousand mark and it's time to push towards 5,000. You dig? Then 10, 20, we, we pushing, man. So let's get to 5,000 subscribers. That's the new goal. I set that goal right there. I set that, uh, you know, got to set those standards or otherwise uh, I'll be thinking a little smaller and I can't be smaller so the standards got to be high but we're gonna get there though and let's get there man now let's get straight to the video though something that's very important something you youngsters need to take heed to something you older fellas that fight here ambulance or hell could it be police anything go on you did but um we get to the video before you see your citizens you know it doesn't matter for every man this is for men. This is for us men. This is for you men, and you men need to gravitate to this. You know what I'm saying? Lying and shit, you know? And this is so real. <clears throat> Fellas, you can't be lying because you never know where it can go. You know, like dude in the video, you never he never knew how, where it could, you know, where it could, it could win into his favor. You never know. That's why you got to keep it real, you know? And um, this is the importance of not lying. The importance of not lying, fellas, is that the world can open up to you. Anything can happen for you. Everything can go through for you. We know these things. A lot of you fellas may not know these things, but some of you fellas do. But I'm trying to get you guys on one accord so you guys will automatically know that um, a woman is just a woman. She's a human being. She's not no one special. She's not no one that you need to lie to. You get it? She shits, piss, bleeds, go to sleep, wake up, funky ass, breath, fart, talk shit, have an attitude, <clears throat> anger and everything just like you. You dig? So what makes her different? She's not no extra terrestrial, you know, alien or someone that's, you know, just like this out of the view type person that you never seen before that you look at and you just get historical behind, right? Hysterical, I meant to say. So when you get hysterical behind, right? Now, if you was to see God right through this earth, moving around like a tornado, asking, what have you done the night before? 
and you see that he's casting this person that way, that person that way, this person that way, that person. Yeah, you're going to eventually lie. You don't want to get thrown off nowhere, you know. You're going to lie, you know, to the police or whatever in certain situations, you know. We know these things occur, but lying to a woman, to your woman at that, is booty as a motherfucker. Can't be doing that shit, man. Because for one, when you lie to her, she look at you as beneath her. She don't look at you as above her no more. She like, this motherfucker right here it ain't shit. You know, he ain't no man. He don't stand on his word. What else he been lying about? You know, because that show her inconsistency when you start lying. And that's when they be on their bullshit. They'll start playing them games. They'll be sort you know, maneuvering your ass around on some bullshit because you are not true to yourself. You're not true to her. You're not true to society and whole. You must stand firm on your shit. You must be the man. You must stand tall. And a lot of you guys... You lie because you don't want to lose your woman. You lie because you don't want to lose a certain situation. You know, you lie because you don't want to be seen as this, you know, certain type of person when you shouldn't give a fuck how nobody look at you. You know what I'm saying? When you shouldn't give a fuck if she leaves. You shouldn't care. So why lie? A lot of you guys lie because you don't want to lose your chick. I get it. I understand that. But what I don't understand is that, um, what makes you think that she's different than you? She's got skin. Mother, you pinch her skin, that motherfucker hurt. You pinch my skin, it's going to hurt. You know, I might punch your ass out or whatever, but, you know, hey, you, you get it. We're human beings. When he gave old girl that, and y'all see it in the video, when he gave old girl that number, he should have let her know, hey, my woman downstairs, but I am feeling you. I'm feeling you like that. And, um... I don't want to speak on a polygamy situation, but I, it'll be nice if I get y'all two together. Because I believe she's hot. I'm looking at you, you hot. Shit, I'm fine as a motherfucker, so shit. We can go ahead and just go ahead and make the sandwich happen. You dig? You got to put that out there. Let her know that. And not give a fuck if she be like, nah, I ain't with that shit. You got me f walk off. Okay, and bye. The next motherfucker might be with it. You know? Or, shit, I could just say, hey, fuck it. Just kick it with my chick. You know? She ain't going to come out. Lashing out on you, seeing you with your woman, tripping out. And, oh, you, she's not going to come out like that because you let her know what it is. And if she come downstairs or wherever she come to and she see you with your chick, she's going to keep pushing. Oh, he wasn't lying. I'm just not with that. So I'm gone. It's just a rejection, man. Let it go. Keep going. You got a woman. You cool, right? Let it go and keep going. That's all you got to do. So <clears throat> I did just say, if he... Told her what was real, and she went with it. She went with the idea. She, okay, you got a woman. At least, I mean, that's cool. That's what's up. I mean, y'all on the verge of breaking up or y'all, no, we ain't doing none of that. I like you, though. I'm feeling you. And I believe just by the glimpse of what I'm seeing, shit, I want to jump in your pants. I'm sexually attracted to you. Just like that. Let her know. She go, <laughs> she'd be a little submitting, whatever, you know. And if she go for it, she go for it. And then you can bring her down to your woman. Your woman ain't going to wig out because this is your woman. You already got that set in play with her from the beginning. She already know how you are. She know who you are. She's still with you. So she know there's a chance you're going to be trying to bring some ass back to the spot, you know. As long as that ass is nice, just as nice and looking as her, you know, then it won't be nothing. She won't probably won't even trip. And the chick will probably look a little better than you never know. Your woman probably want to taste her just as well. That's just how it go, man. Or if your woman ain't with it, your woman's, if she's with it and your woman ain't with it, then, you know, your woman's just not with it. She's with it. But your woman know what type of dude you are. She know that you ain't going to dump that off. She's coming along for the ride. So she, take this number and holler at me. Or, you know, we're going to go. She, your woman knows that you will be eventually banging this because she know you. She know what type of guy you are. She accepted you for who you are. So there's no hiding shit. And 10, I don't want to say nine times out of 10 that she's going to ride along with the program and go and fuck with you and no girl. I'm not really going to say that, but there's a main, there's a, there's a big nine, nine times out of 10, 10 times out of 10. If she's filling your program, she's going to fuck with you and her and bring y'all all together. She may not like it, you know, but it's all about making you happy. She wants to make you happy. 
So she's G. She, she's good with that. You dig? But you guys don't understand that part of life because y'all lie so fucking much. And I'm not knocking guys for lying because I've lied before. I've done, I've lied a lot to get some ass back when I was younger. I was 40 years old. When I was 16, 15, 17, yeah, I was doing that shit. Make myself seem like better than who I am to, you know, touch bases on that ass. And I, I did those things. But as I got older, I seen that I can get more and a lot more by telling the truth. And I'm secure within myself. So if she reject me, I don't give a fuck. I don't care about that. I've been rejected by thousands of women. I mean, I've hollered so many women. I've been rejected by thousands of them. I've also been picked up and smashed <laughs> by a lot of them. So it kind of, it's, it goes, it's peanut butter and jelly, man. It is what it is. You know, it goes hand in hand. But when you haven't had that experience and you haven't been around like that, then you feel like, oh, shit, you know, you're going to instantly jump into that scarcity mode. You're going to get scared and you're going to instantly lie like him. He, putting no girl down, talking shit on her and doing all that shit in front. You made yourself look weak in front of your woman. He made himself look weak in front. His woman ain't even going to respect him. I guarantee you she ain't going to respect him. His woman probably, they probably got down the street. She like, like shit, damn, you could at least bought her. You, you could at least told the truth and bought her along. Cause, <laughs> I was fucking little Tommy and Leroy. You see, I, I been doing my thing. He don't know that. But he's sitting up here lying to her and she could be already doing her thing. So why lie? You don't know what's, what's out there. I mean, she may not be cheating and she may be cheating. She may be that type of person. And you sitting up there not, you know, lying and not telling the truth. Come on, homeboy. If I was in that situation, man, I would have bagged that bitch like it wasn't shit. And my woman would have knew what was up. Or I'm going to step out and do my thing because you know this is what I do. If you don't agree with it, I'm going to do my thing. Anyway, that's what this relationship's about. Us, you know, trusting each other and, you know, agreeing to disagree, you know, that, that you know, and um, you being down for me and I'm being down for you. So in this moment, you know, you need to let me, you need to go ahead and let me do my thing. Because if you don't, I'm going to do it anyway. And if your woman know these things about you, she's going to carry along with you. Real shit. You know, and if she ain't with it, she ain't with it. She can... <laughs> you know, keep fucking with you and let you do your thing. But she'll be down for you. Don't lie. Why lie? I mean, I don't get it. She's just a human being just like you. You mean, the worst can happen is, no, I ain't fucking with you. You got a woman. The best thing can happen is, hey, I'm trying to fuck with you and your woman. Yeah, fellas. Your woman will lose a whole lot of respect for you. Once you start lying, you're not that same person and it's not going to be the same no more. The respect is not going to come back. Trust me. You're not the same person that she thought, you know, you're not that person that she thought she had from the beginning. She's not that real motherfucker like she thought she really had. She know you a fraud. You fake. You know what I'm saying? You scared as a motherfucker. You know, you, you, you sneaky as fuck and you ain't standing on shit. So how you going to be sneaky and not stand on? As a man that make you look real bitch made. Like these videos, share them, and subscribe. This is real talk, man. Like I said, we trying to hit a couple thousand. Three, four, five, two, three, four, five. That's better. Let's get there. You know, fellas, that's the importance of not lying. You never know what can come out in your favor. You never know. Now, like I said, I've lied before. I don't knock men, young men that's lying out here and, you know, to get ahead of time. Because I can't knock you and I've done those things. I'm not going to never knock you. Because I've done the same shit, man. But as you get older. You want to know the truth is within. Bring that shit out and tell that shit. Tell the truth. See how far I can go. You know what I'm saying? Hey, shit, motherfucker can't handle the truth and they, they can't handle you. And you don't want a motherfucker who can't handle you, right? No. Kick the ass the curve anyway, man. Real talk. Like I said, a thousand better is a go. Let's get there. Holla.